Great. Now, I received a letter from one of our viewers on the, one of the issues that you spoke about. But quickly, be, beyond you consistently talking about this 51 billion, over 51 billion mm -hmm. that Mr. Um, Flu has petitioned the speaker on, what can be done to, to cause some action to be taken? Because this, this amount of money is no chicken change. And if it is missing and it can be found and accounted for, beyond the advocacy here, what can be done? Yeah, so we have to go into court looking at it. You're going to go to court. We have to go into court. But you see, because in recent times, some of these cases that affect government, we don't usually get that much success. Uh, you are wondering whether, and it's true, the best time will be to wait until after the elections, you see, because this affects governance. You remember the last time we went into court over this Domlevo matter? Yes, I admit we too, at a latter part, we are also not um, forthcoming with filing our processes, but the larger majority of the delay is on the Supreme Court. And why? Because they wanted to give a coup for enough time. So with the way that case was handled, slow, 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 and by the time the Supreme <coughs> Court acted, Ikufuadu had gotten away with murder. It gives me a bit of, I'm unsure. You see, I'm unsure. And don't forget, there's even a second case against uh, Habib. Uh, what is it called? Honorable Habib, your yeah, colleague. Yeah, Which yeah. consequence is that? Uh, Tolong. Tolong? Yeah. There's a case against Habib for stealing. You see the Australian record. A stealing conviction. The case has been in the Supreme Court over two years. It's not oh. been dealt with. So, and there are other cases. So, when it's that, you see a certain pattern. You see a certain pattern. Because Habib's case is over two years. Ah, as a court, if you see that thing and you see a conviction ceiling, how can you not go for it? You see this? Yet, when it came to this four MPs case, quickly, the Supreme Court said, oh, we'll give judgment uh, November 11. Habib's case is over two years. So, so you, you're going to consider stealing. going to court ah, on this? Yeah, but... Okay. You know, when you look at certain cases, when they affect okay. government, then they are slow, slow, then you see okay. a certain disturbing trend. Uh, you, no, you, but no, just, just, a, a, just, quick, a, quick one. just a comment, mm -hmm. yeah, just a quick one. You see, uh, lawyer Martin Pebo is, is right. Uh, the Auditor General is an officer of Parliament, actually. That's how it's supposed to be. But unfortunately, it's been very difficult sometimes, even Parliament directing the Auditor General, to do certain things for us. It is what he does and brings, which get laid. That is now referred to the Public Accounts Committee to look into and bring a report for consideration at what a uh, plenary. Then, once approved, we write what we must write to the Attorney General for prosecution. But one thing is clear. We are less than 30 days from an election. Mm -hmm. John Dramani Mahama has launched what we call oral operation retrieve all loot since all this advocacy seems not to be working and yielding results i recommend to Ghanaians that on 7th december if you want your 51 billion back to the state to be used for development vote john mahama that for me is my recommendation is it's a shorter way of resolving this matter. So we can go into the books. If you continue to keep those who have supervised this loot at various levels, then you never get your money. Yeah, you will agree. never get your money. If you percent. want your money back, vote for a leader who will come and now go through the books. So much has gone wasted. And so much is still even being wasted in the name of attempting to buy votes. Yeah, well, I agree. So while, while I take, and, and this is an issue that um, because you continuously mention it, mm -hmm. we're going to get into mm -hmm. as well, just mm -hmm. to ensure that um, there's some finality brought to it. Mm -hmm. And there was actually another statement, as I indicated from one of our, one of our viewers um, to you. Mm -hmm. I got a letter okay. um, within the week. Mm -hmm. It says, this is from Dr. Jones Mensah. Good morning. Alfred, mm -hmm. I would want to find out from, uh, it's quite a long one, um, you know, with a lot of mm -hmm. congratulations and all of that for the program and so on. That's one, thank you. Yeah. But he says, yeah, essentially... Now we are it, the chats, eh? They must listen and watch program. Good. 
and he says, I want to find out from lawyer Martin Pebble mm -hmm. um, what has become of the Cecilia Dapa case. Ah. Because beyond greeting all the people who have been talking about it every morning on your show, we need an update on the case as well, okay. since he is a lawyer. But I've just got to put on record, he's not a lawyer on this matter. Mm -hmm. um, you know. Yeah, so as as you know, know, but we've sued Attorney General over that interpretation. So the mm. Attorney General has uh, used he and Yoko, Mamiti Wadudankwa, saying that oh, they don't see uh, this uh, money laundering, blah, blah, blah. So we've sued them for the interpretation because once her income doesn't support that, she it, it's in the realm of money laundering. We sued in, uh, was it sometime in July? Well, the courts have just returned, so we'll be moving the court. Yeah, so Dr. Mm -hmm. Jones Mensah, mm -hmm. like, what does he do? Where is he? So he, sa he says, t t this one is from Taiman. Oh, okay. Taiman, so okay, Dr. Taiman. Jones yes. Mensah of Taiman. So we'll yeah. be giving an update. We'll push for the case to be heard. Oh, this matter, we are not leaving it. No, if we do that, we we'll encourage politicians to loot this whole country, then it means that we are foolish. Because you sit, you try to do private sector a little in your corner, and then people go into government and loot everything. No, it's not going to happen. Uh, no. the, the last time I checked, the, the, this case was called about two or three weeks ago at the mm -hmm. High Court, mm -hmm. where um, the High Court directed us OSP uh, to, to provide means the, the criminal the, side. The investigation okay. portion and, and the charge statement. Yes, but let's explain this. Unfortunately, the High Court matter is a poor house girl. They are being prosecuted. Oh. Let's understand mm -hmm. this. The case in the high court is against patients' butchery. Yes. They are being prosecuted. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, the one who brought the money, Sister Adapa and her husband, and who can't explain the source of the money, they have been let go. That's, and that's how come we have sued the Attorney General in Yoko to make sure that the interpretation they are giving to the law, saying that, oh, they need a predicate offense. It's a ruse. We've changed the law. You don't need mm -hmm. a predicate offense. If you find too much money with somebody and the person can't explain the source of that income, then you are in the realm of money laundering. If it okay. is government money, it's Yoko that deals with it. If it is private money, then it's the CID. That's the effect of the Supreme Court decision in ex parte Ibrahim. I see. So the bottom line of this matter is that the money has been released yes it's unfortunately been returned, it's been returned to cecilia Dapa. I, I, unfortunately she has the right to spend it hmm. that's why i said yes, yoko has to she, she has no right but because what? you know yoko ah tiwa do dan kwa ekufado sapwenti ekufado wrote uh cecilia Dapa a love letter my dear cecilia etc so you can see there's collusion so tiwa do dan kwa allow the money to go because remember we we're on this show when osp gave notice that they were going to return the money to Cecilia Adapa, we kept saying that, hey, then Yoko should make sure that at the point of release, at the point of release, they will be there to take over. They never showed. And OSV did well, at least Kisia Jabin did well by publicly telling us that at this uh, juncture, he's going to release the money. And we sat right here and made noise that, hey, Tiwa Dudankwa, make sure your officers are there. So that as soon as the money is handed over to Cecilia Adapa, you also take it. But because they had already colluded between Godfrey Dami, who should have been out of office mm -hmm. over this Jakwati, mm -hmm. and uh, this uh, uh, Tiwa Dodankwa, they didn't do it. They allowed the money to be given to uh, Cecilia Adapa. It was a collusion. I mean, there was, there was uh, some power play or theft yeah. amongst themselves as to who has to do what and so on, and whether there was an establishment of money laundering and other. You remember how things played out between uh, those no. institutions? It's a ruse. That's, that's if so. We, why do you say there was collusion? Oh, I Why? see the collusion because, you see, this is what happened. Don't forget, as I said, Tiwa Dudankwa. Yoko said they hadn't established. Tiwa Dudankwa is the same woman that when the uh, 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 paying money to see a Kufuado came up, Tiwa Dudankwa was recorded by A+, plus, begging A+, plus that, hey, don't raise this matter. Otherwise, you make a Kufuado unpopular. That was the case against uh, uh, this, uh, Samuel Abujinapo, Minister for Lands and Forestry, uh, as in Subwachi, Minister for uh, the, the Public Works, the Works and Housing, mm -hmm. right? And Tiwa the Dankwa. the Minister for Roads now. No. Uh, he's hey. been, he's then, been rich up. Uh, okay. Okay. Works, okay. No. Minister for Roads, you see? You're promoting people who should well, be, well, not but, be but near I mean, that you, office. You, you, Good. So, so this Tiwa Dankwa, who was recorded begging, trying to clean up a Kufuado's mess. The same Tiwa Dankwa who sat on the, uh, this, where's the, la the lady? Uh, 
Say what Bruni a for those girlfriends matter. No, no, no. Oh, she said it. Say what Bruni is a citizen. She said she dated a coup for those. Please, we can say it. Say what Bruni is a lie. Has a coup for those suit. Say what Bruni for saying that she was dating a coup for those. She said coup for those is her boyfriend. We can say it. Then they say Papa no no. When you were in office, then they say. Cancel. She said it. You, she ah, said it, you mean, but it's, it's, it's not an issue that... When Ekufuado promised to uh, yeah, you sue on. Al Jazeera, the gold okay. mafia, has he mm -hmm. been able to sue Al Jazeera? Al Jazeera said he was involved in gold scam, etc. Has Ekufuado sued Al Jazeera over a year now? So what Bruni says she dated Ekufuado? Ekufuado is my boyfriend. You, you, ah, you so, said she so shouldn't cancel. say it. Cancel. Okay, so there, uh -huh, let's, let's go on. on. Uh -huh. an so I've counted two about. cases, then 10 cases against Mami Tiwa Dudankwa. The Takradi girls. Oh, sorry. Anytime I remember it, then my heart bleeds. You know, how can you deceive families like that? No, you know, the families were already down. Then Tiwa Dudankwa came that, oh, they had found the girls. They know where they are. You raise their hopes just to suit the political, uh, you know, uh, establishment. Then it turned out that you couldn't produce the girls. So me, from T. Wadu Dankwe's track record, these three cases I've mentioned, which are publicly uh, known, that's why she continued into this fourth case of allowing Cicely Adapa to have the money. If you, if you say allowing, that is the it. court, the matter was taken to court. The court ruled, is it not? Ah, no, no. The court said OSP couldn't, uh, listen, OSP actually uh, withdrew. So it's not a substantive ruling. So OSP decided to withdraw because they didn't have any further uh, evidence at the time. Don't forget, mm -hmm. if they get evidence today, they can return. So they said they are withdrawing. So based upon withdrawing the yes. charges, et cetera, then the court made the order. So the one you call ruling. Except yes. that I want us to remember so that people will not think, oh, they went into the case and right. the other power won. No, OSP withdrew. So the court ruled Awaiting that. Awaiting further evidence. Excellent. Thank you so very much. This but case can be reopened. Any time. When so the further evidence is provided thank you. to the OSP. So then the justice, the judge ruled that, okay, then in that case, okay. return the money. Well, no, no, no. On the basis that they have seen more of a money uh, laundering yes. rather than what it yes. was that they thank were you. thinking. So thank they you. found something. Yes. But just that they thought it's not within their purview. Thank you. So the understanding is that whilst the court was ruling for a return, yes. the institution that has the capacity mm -hmm. to deal with the money law will immediately kick in and, and, and pick okay. it. Thank that you. was where the failure thank of the institutions uh -huh. right. of state. Thank you. And we made the noise here that, hey, Mamiti Wadudankwa, make sure Make sure that at the point of release of the money, you are there to take it. This common sense. Come on, come on. And they didn't. And you think, and then you look at the Attorney General's letter. Then you see that there's collusion. Collusion. My dear Cecilia, <coughs> then to Attorney General, who is uh, what? Covering the president, doing Jakarta, uh, suborning witness, coaching witnesses to go and lie to the court and still keeping his office. Ah, collusion between so them. So you're, you're in court on this. And for yeah. your intent to go to court and... On, on another aspect of this case yes. as well. Yes. So we'll wait for it. Yeah. And every time you say you go to court on one thing or the other, I put it on record because yeah. our viewers as well would be yeah, so we have two cases now. Accountability from you. We have two cases now. Mm -hmm. That's a uh, Cicely Adapa matter. That the interpretation the Attorney General is putting on uh, this money laundering is wrong. So that okay. if we get the, wrong, the, the correct interpretation, that we don't need a predicate offense, so that the docket can be reopened and continued. Then number two, the SML deal. Yeah, with pseudo Foriata. You should come and answer. Uh, Foriata and, and, and the when, rest. When is, when SML. Is, when and is, that's the one they when, gave when, over when, $1 billion when is of the case money. supposed to be called? Uh, we sued them. They are supposed to respond. They haven't. So there are some steps we can take to move the case forward. We are right. on that. Well, mm -hmm. we just got Actually, some, some people who are yet to be served. Yeah, there are many. So some of them are yet to be served. So when everybody's served, you know, we're on legal vacation. I wasn't even here. You see, uh -huh. so uh -huh. as I was in here, there was slow progress. So now we are trying to tidy up that, and then we'll go forward.